Hi, I want to show some of the new features of Csound Qt 0.7.0. The first thing you'll notice when you open it, apart from the name change, it's now Csound Qt, is that the editor has line numbers on the display and a new set of more serious looking icons. Uh, you also have a new option to see a split view. So the CSD file is split into separate parts and the score is shown as a spreadsheet. So you can actually do uh, operations there as you would uh, in live event sheets. So you can add and uh, copy paste in a very simple way. And it just goes back and forth from the spreadsheet to the regular uh, text score. Um, you will also find in the help panel a new uh, find uh, search bar. Um, this will help you find within the page all the occurrences of, of strings, which can be uh, very useful. There's also a new feature that lets you export uh, widgets for the Cabbage system. So you can automatically generate the text for Cabbage from the widget panel. This will only, of course, um, include the widgets that are compatible between both, but this includes uh, the buttons, the checkboxes, the sliders, and the knobs, which will be uh, what you mostly need. Um, there's also uh, a large number of new examples. First, the Floss Manual examples, so that you can follow along the Floss Manual uh, book. Um, so it's very convenient, you don't have to type them, and you can try them straight away. There's also uh, the great uh, McCurdy collection, with tons of very interesting instruments, uh, very well explained, um, and with very uh, useful and nice interfaces. So they really work a, a, a good look. Another important new feature, and one of the reasons why this release took so long, was is the addition of a, a Python scripting and a Python console and Scratchpad. So what you can do with this is interact with the Csound uh, Qt uh, interface, the widgets, and the running Csound instances. So you can have uh, execute Python code using uh, evaluate selection or Alt E, and this will run the file and has sent the event for processing. You can also use the console to send uh, changes. For the, both for the um, C sound engine and the uh, widgets. I, uh, I've also added uh, a few examples uh, from different people, like a realization of Koenig's essay uh, with a full interface that renders all of the tape pieces and then splices them together. Um, and uh, it shows uh, some of the possibilities of what you can do with this, like live coding. So you can define your functions there, and then you can send a block of events together. Evaluate it in real time. So thanks very much for watching.